The moon has become a dancer at this festival of love, this dance of light, this sacred blessing, this divine love beckons us to a world beyond only lovers can see with their eyes a fiery passion. They are the chosen ones who have surrendered. Once they were particles of light, now they are the radiant sun. They have left behind the world of deceitful games. They are the privileged lovers who create a new world with their eyes of fiery passion. Elizabeth has always dreamed of getting married in the Little Green Church, and I'm glad your dream came true today, Elizabeth. My greatest wish for the two of you is through the years you will love each other, will so deepen and grow for the years from now, and you will look back on this day, your wedding day, as the day you loved each other the least. So here's to the groom, a man who keeps his head, though he lost his heart. Well, Elizabeth, thank you for this honor and the joy you have brought us by being you. Very early on the relationship, Elizabeth said to me, he's my one. And I remember that so clearly and distinctly. Um, and I never questioned it. I always knew that that was true from that day on. Um, and it was easy to see their connection through the way they enjoyed being really silly with each other, um, the way that they were both game for whatever new was coming up, their love for great food, and of course, sharing all of this with the people around them. Aloha, welcome. You are in Waioli Huia Church. It means gathering place of joyful waters. And this is certainly a joyful and happy occasion and celebration that we, we gather here for. Here we stand. The world awaits. Well, let the stars tonight light the way. Dwayne and Elizabeth, among all the person that you've both known and loved in this life, you have chosen each other to be partners on your life journey together from this point on as husband and wife. Dwayne, you've been my best friend, mentor, playmate, confidant, and even my greatest challenge. But most importantly, you're the love of my life. Dwayne. I take you as my husband and, and as an equal. I pledge to share my life openly with you and to speak the truth to you in love. I promise to honor and tenderly care for you, to cherish and to encourage your own fulfillment as an individual through all our changes of, in our lives. It captures Elizabeth, you are my best friend and my love. You make me the best version of myself and I will love you forever. Elizabeth, I take you as my wife and equal. I pledge to share my life openly with you and to speak the truth to you in love. I promise to honor, honor and tenderly care for you, to cherish and encourage your own fulfillment as an individual through all the changes of our lives. Well, Dwayne and Elizabeth, you have spoken your vows to each other in our presence, in the presence of God, in this time and place. And because you have done that, and because you now are living a new life, may it be known and affirmed and celebrated that you are now husband and wife. And if you would like to seal it with an expression of infection, <laughs> that is your choice.